Hello everyone, this is Mimi from Mimi's Crafty Shop and I am bringing to you this beautiful um, paper bag glassing um, journal that I have recently made for a custom order for Miss Irene. And I just wanted to do a little video on it before I mailed it off to her. I thought it turned out really cute. She wanted something um, either in uh, for uh, vintage ladies, kind of the peaches, the creams, the pinks, colors. So I'm hoping that um, this is what she was wanting. Uh, it turned out really cute, I think. I love these colors and stuff and these pictures. So I uh, actually took some different bags and just um, sewed them together. Um, put a strip of material in between them, kind of like a muslin. I'll show you that in a minute and get this untied. This is um, seam binding ribbon here. And um, this is a beautiful flowers that I put on the front. Did some embellishing with this beautiful lace here, these dangle lace. Um, it's kind of a peachy blushy color. And this is a like, wedding applique paper dually. And on the back, similar to the same thing, I did get um, this beautiful lace here from um, Su Susan from TM Tiffany and um, it's so pretty I used a lot of her stuff in my things these right here these are some really cool uh, paper clips that I recently got when I went to Austin reuse I thought they were really neat you know it's neat to get some different kind of paper clips every once in a while so I put a couple of them on here and let's get started on the book here I embossed this paper bag as a white one. I recently got some of these from t um, Tuesday morning. Me and my mom did. And I uh, just put a big old ephemera of this rose here on here. And let's see, what do I got in here? I had to be careful on my weight on this one. So I had to be not over embellish it. It was so hard too because I love to embellish. So I had to really watch myself because we wanted to keep it under a certain amount. Uh, this is just a paper dually that I recently got from um, Tattered Dreams, um, Denise, I think, and it's this kind of oval one, and I put this napkin on there, and it's this La Rose, La Rose Journal, and this is actually a glassing bag here, and I had put this beautiful uh, music paper in there, and I just took one of these guest checks, these pink ones, and embellished it up with some different things and did put a little dangle down here, some little lace. So I just recently got these guest checks. I ordered them from Amazon. So I was tickled, tickled, tickled to get them. Been seeing everybody use the guest checks, so I finally got me some. Put that back on there. And I just did a lot of sewing on here. This is actually parchment paper that I had did some tea dyeing on and I thought it turned out really pretty. I love the crinkly sound of it. I just took and kind of did a collage and sewed all these together. And did a collage with this, cut out this dress form. Um, this is a die cut and just some paper behind it. This paper right here, I just absolutely love it. I just got it recently in a um, um, scrapbook. Uh, paper kit that I got. I did this stamping on here. I love this stamp. It's one of my favorites. And did some butterflies that kind of represent this. And this right here is actually a pocket. So, and you can see how I put these together. I took two, actually two glassine or two paper bags and laid them down and glued this uh, muslin on there. And, um, just kind of left a little space in between them so therefore when I got it all laid down I sewed down the middle of it like um, a signature and this is a beautiful card in here that she can use and this right here is um, some lace that I recently got from Essie and Tiffany Lane Susan uh, I bought this from her recently. I seen where some people were using this lace and it's just gorgeous. I love it. It is just beautiful. And these paper bags I got from Amazon. I thought they were really pretty. Kind of a different texture colors with the little uh, 
stripes on there. And I just put this little lace down here, the heart lace and some different ones. These are some smaller glassing bags that I recently got and just filled them up with some goodies. Put this ruffle lace on there. Just these, this, I was kind of a little bit, uh, whenever Irene asked me to make her a glassine bag or a paper bag journal, I hadn't really ever made one, so I had to kind of like do a little research on there. So I finally figured out how to do it. And this is a beautiful um, scrap of paper that's double-sided. I just love it. It's so pretty. And here's some beautiful pictures here and some scrapbook paper. Love the way these two dyed up. Isn't that gorgeous? And here's the other side of the glassing, the small glassing bag. I did a little tag here with a, um, just some lace and stuff. And then this is just a vintage um, receipt paper here that I printed out. Little tab. And I put this lace over here on the side on this one and that little cut out some of those little rosettes and just put some paper inside there. And this here is a really pretty, um, I think I might have, I can't remember who I got this from, but I did get it from somebody. I can't think of her name right now. I think her name is Jeannie. And this right here is a pocket and I sewed it on and put, just did some embellishing on there. You can see how I did that embellishing. I, I did cut out this vintage lady and this rose as a sticker and put some of this wedding uh, applique lace on there. Some glue. And then I had just recently got Tim Holtz uh, dress, this dress form die cut. So I had been cutting out these gorgeous dress forms and I just love this picture here of this lady. And just put this on the parchment paper. Kind of a little collage up. It's another little collage I did up, and it says, for my dear friend. And she can cover that up if she wants to. I, I just left it that way. And here is another um, beautiful picture that I did up. And this actually opens up. Uh, let me see if I can get it undone. Do it to me if I can. It's kind of a tricky little thing. It's a little one of those envelopes that Lori Girl on the Ridge does, and I just took and kind of did some stamping on the side of it. So, I'll tie that back in a minute. Here's another glassing bag, and let's see what's in here. Beautiful paper again that kind of matches and goes with the blue on the lady's dress. And then one of these cards, which I absolutely love these. My mother gave these to me. It's one of my favorite cards. And I did this, this is from SM Tiffany Lane again. Um, I bought this from her and it's just gorgeous. It's so vintage looking with that ribbon. I mean, it's kind of, it's just got a vin real vintage look about it. And put some more of that music paper behind here and sewed this on. This is actually a pocket too, two pockets. And let's see what's in here. It's another beautiful card that I put in here for her that she made can use. And she can fill these up even more so. Um, she said she didn't want one that had a lot of writing, uh, writing space on it because she was not a journaler. So she, I basically didn't put any of that in here. And this is the back again. So anyway, this is gonna be sent, sent to Miss Irene and I just wanted to do a quick little video share on it. So thank y'all so much for watching and y'all have a blessed day.